Let's see, man. Y'all might get mad at me for coming so often. Man, I had to make this video, man. Let me tell you something, man. Um, ladies and gentlemen, lions and lioness. Uh, this guy done already been told. Let Chicago take care of Chicago. Right? What'd he do? He didn't come in on Houston a couple of times wearing Houston Astros uh, hat, jersey. Well, he paid for that, but I don't think he's worthy of wearing it. Anyway, now he come in it on this Astro, Astro World stuff. You know. Trying, I guess, trying not to lay out of them rappers or whatever. But in our town, they gonna get to the root of it. Just don't know all the details, okay? But he even came up with this theory. Um, you know, I know he got a bunch of sheep that follow him and everything. But anyway, he done come up with this grand old opera theory that the, the demons and this and that. Okay, it had some in there. But what he failed to realize, it shot way over his head because it might go deeper than that, but they gonna find out. Okay, I say that to say this. They got rappers in our city like when he be riding in that car and then the other one and he jamming off of Jay-Z or somebody and, and, and rocking his head and showing that he, he shooting a gun or whatever. I'm telling y'all, man, this dude is on the fence. And we got, we got a whole lot of ambulance chase in this city. We got a whole lot of record drivers. Okay? They sit under the freeway. They wait when it's raining, especially. They wait for somebody to have a bad accident or something. There they go swooping down faster than the law get there. This is all this man doing, man. I'm telling y'all. He's an ambulance chaser. He can't predict nothing that before it happened. If you ever notice something that happened, then he in on it. He he got the whole solution and answer. Did he go back to getting on top of that fence? You know, I'm, I'm, I'm fed up with this mess, man. He ain't taking care of no children. Can't take care of his own children. Speaking on women, lions, and lioness, and uh, have all, everything twisted all up, man. How we gonna make it like that? You wanna hear a Houston rapper? Let me, let me, let me show y'all something. This is a Houston rapper that spoke on what happened at World. Let me see. I got three phones. Let me see. Yeah, I got it. This World tragedy just a few days ago with the video that he posted to his Instagram. I need everybody before I play the video to smash the like button, share the video, make sure you guys subscribe to Hip Hop News Uncensored for more exclusives just like this one. Rotate. by not everybody know everything that happened well they know what happened um, at Astro World Friday night many people lost their lives hundreds of people injured passing out cardiac arrest traveling all kind of shit and um you know I feel like a lot of people saw a lot of things That's Bomb B. Friday night. Like, I'm, as, as a full grown man, that's seen a lot of shit. It took me a couple of days to really kind of process what was happening. What had happened. Excuse me. Good morning. But, um, I wasn't even.
even there. And I feel a certain way. Like Queenie wasn't even there. I'm extremely emotional about the situation. And, um, you know, for me, the first thing I thought about was, you know, what, what the people that we knew, so I know what's safe. And then, you know, I started thinking about, you know, there were people that died, there were people that were injured, but then there was a lot of people in the proximity of all of that, there was a lot of people that, that witnessed this shit, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of people out there trying to help people, and please fell on deaf ears, that's trauma. <laughs> Like, you know, you were trying to save people's lives and you, and you didn't or you couldn't. It's trauma. Watching these people being stepped on, traumatized. That's trauma. You know, witnessing, you know, people going into cardiac arrest, trying to help people, can't help people. It's trauma. For people, on top of the trauma that the people are actually feeling these physical acts, I suffer with. And, um, you know, yesterday morning I flew out to L.A. to go to Complex Club. And every flight that was leaving, you know, out of the airport, every flight going wherever you were going, um, I was flying with friends to L.A. We won one flight, they won another flight. And, um, with Astro people going home on that, on, on, the, on that plane as well. Every plane was bringing people home from Asheville. And I was with this, you know, I wasn't with, but I sat next to this kid. And this kid was, you know, I could see his phone, he was playing Travis Scott music. You could see he was, you know, clearly disappointed by how things went and he just kind of played his music and kept his head down, eyes closed. He didn't drink food, he, he didn't drink water or anything. And it didn't occur to me until it Okay. That's part of what Bomb B said. He said a whole lot in this video. Matter of fact, let me uh shout out to him soon. Let me see. Let me get this right. I wanna give them a shout out. Uh so y'all can check it out. Let's see. Okay. It's uh hip 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 hop news uncensored. Say is that these are the after effects of these, these 
You know, they'll figure out who they're from. What are we not getting to as a community with this? We said no. I'm gonna cut this short. See what Bum B said? A whole lot of them come from different places all over the world. See what Bum B said? We got channel 13, we got channel 11, we got channel 2, we got channel 39, we got channel 26. Why do we need? somebody forecasting what they think in our city what's going on if they not a Amalance chaser or a record driver we got all of this and Bum B say he don't even know okay homeboys say oh they say that's about a needle somebody had a needle yeah idiot yeah dummy a guard got stuck in the neck and they had to give him Narcan. He was old in. You went into this fifth and sixth dimensional shit, but I'm not saying it's not a, it, it don't exist. But you don't need to, just like they told you about Chicago, man, you don't need to speak on nothing that I was city, man. If Bum B throw the concert tonight, I'd go to it, man. Slim Thug, any one of them. Lil Flip, any one of them. These guys, they take care of their community, man. You can't mess up unless you get in their game, man. You need to quit hating on them rappers, man. As long as you, I see you were talking about Jay Prince. You had him on and had Astro shit. Man, you ain't worried enough to wear that shit, man. These Houston people, man, they don't go for none of that. You got them sheep following you. You know what I'm saying? Talking about you, you, you can't do nothing with them fellas in New York. You better not post up. Keep on riding in that car, shaking your head and showing that you're shooting a gun and oh, uh, rolling, listening to Jay Z and showing niggas getting shot all down the street, young niggas. What kind of niggas you man? You tell on yourself. You ain't see well. You ain't see what Kwame made a joke of you about that old video you made with that with that boy touching you. Man, them the kind of things you need to try to talk to youngsters to not go to be in your position, man. And you're always on on the fence. You're straddling the fence. One day you for the kids, and the next day you a gangster. Man, what kind of nigga is you, man? Let me tell you something. When I be calling these dudes alpha males and alpha females, man, believe that, man. Tell me. Ten told down made a video that I ain't never seen nobody do, not even in Houston, man, because they all be together anyway. They just, they ride together, they swing together. You might not know what swinging is. They swing downtown. Police get out their way when they swinging. They show them respect. 
They stay in their own thing. They make their own music. They take care of them children, man. But let me show you something. You was such a hell of a hell of a. Do something like a uh, Ten Toe Down did. You know what Ten Toe Down did? He made a video. He had them boys with the red flag. Now, I ain't never seen this. He had them boys with the red flag, with the blue flag, and the yellow flag all together. Speaking on how to get together to the community. They had a whole crew up, man, about three or four other dudes. One of them Mexican tatted from. He was tatted from here to his feet, man. You know what he had across his shoulder? Tied together? He had a red flag, a blue flag, and a yellow flag tied together. Something that Ten Toe Down organized, man. These do real, man. Then you, you, who you think you be getting your opinion to, man? Somebody that's stupid? Them people that follow you, them sheeps, all that go. Big poppy. Man, let me tell you something. Montana woke them, pull your whole card. Man, you don't got your whole card. Real niggas don't get their whole card pulled, man, because it's all good. Real niggas, let me tell you something, man. Let me give you a history lesson. Real niggas keep it real all the time. They don't straddle no fence when... Who you working for? Who you working for? Because... I don't know who you working for, man. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Because, let me tell you something, man. We don't need your help. We don't need your help eight at all on trying to diagnose what happened down here. <clears throat> they got a bunch of people that ain't right down here that's in positions in our city. You understand? And if they help plan this stuff for some other reason or something, they gonna find out about them too, man. Because we ain't got no whole bunch of people that's got positions that ain't been bought out. So, I don't know what what, what channel? What, what channel am I supposed to look at you on? Your channel, man. I told you I look at you for entertainment, man. Every time I see you, got on them big old red shoes, man. And you you do it to yourself. That I got to do it because my screen ain't long enough. This long with the polka dot. Let me show you how I expose frauds. You must you must have done forgot. I'm 71 years old, man. Let me show you how I expose frauds. You made the last, I think it was the last video you made. You was live. I made a comment on that. And I asked you, I said, hey man, why you be stepping on these hard hitter toes, man? I say, I'll talk to you one on one. No recording, none of that. I don't want I don't record no fraud. You understand? But you sitting up there, and I know you saw it. You know what you were reading? Oh, thank you, family. Oh, yeah, let me see what. The, thank you, family. Yeah, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, family. You was reading them sheeps. Man, ain't too many sheeps in this city, man. I know you from New York. I know you, when I was coming up. We had, like, Blind Sonny. You ain't never heard of nobody like that. Going to the manual players ball. You ain't never heard of nobody like that, man. You know why? Because you was playing with G.I. Joes. So, that's the kind of advice. Your lifestyle and what you be doing. Man, stay away from this city, man. I'm going to tell you something. You don't want food with this city, man. It's quiet. It's all together. 
We got crooks. We got your flavor. We got all your flavor, man. We got all your flavor. See, the things that we got here, when they come out the closet, they out the closet. They ain't like you. They ain't like you. They ain't like you. They ain't coming out of no closet with no bag and no pistol and try to get in some kind of set. You know why? Them hard dealers ain't having it, man. They gonna see through. You think they don't see through you? Oh, you think when you made that video about J Prince, he need your comments. You you wasn't doing that for no comments, man. You was ambulance chasing, man. Sick of that mess, man. You steady steering these youngsters in the wrong way, man. You wanna holler at me? Send your live. Send your live. I get on my telephone. I don't know too much about this YouTube mess, so I can't be. Only reason I can put Bum B on here, cause I got three phones and I, I had to figure out how to pull it up. I don't even know the number on this phone or this one. Or this one. I don't even know how to do it. Cause I use them for other reasons. So what I'm trying to say to you, man. Just like I done tried to tell you in a couple of other videos, man, you need to find you some business, man. Real seriously. You ain't no psychologist, man, especially with all that trauma and stuff that you done been through, man. Man, stay out of our city, man. Quit one. You know, you done bought the stuff. I can't tell you what to wear. But, man, you ain't worth of wearing no Astro, no Rockets, none of that, even though they lose it. Even, even a Texan. They ain't won a game, I don't think, maybe one. Man. You you be trying to you you chop up them rappers. Okay. You chopping them up. Chop up chop up the rappers, chop up the rappers. These boys in this city, man. Even though they be riding in like Range Rover limousines, don't think they ain't gonna stop to help old lady across the street, man. Don't think they gonna come to our community. I know they gonna come because I stayed on one. You see, you see that, you see that video they made about St. Low. I stayed on the next street, man. For my house burned up, South Hurst. So. You look up some of them H-Town boys. They they get on. They get on outside too. Mike Jones. They get on too. You know. So. Man. They don't need your help. Trying to bring down the industry. Because. People don't got trampled in their concerts. Trying to come and see them. And if it's a demonic reason behind all of that, that these people, they got some good people in here gonna, in this city gonna find out. I'm telling you, they gonna find out. They pressured to find out in this city. You know one thing I can say about New York? Man, my head go off to y'all. My head go off to people in Chicago, Detroit, everywhere, man. I don't know what's going on in y'all city, man. I ain't going to comment on it unless, unless you got an ambulance chaser trying to make his pockets fat off of our city with a false narrative to children. Children, to me, can be 30 years old. I got one in there raising hell right now. My grandbaby. She ain't gonna even listen to you, man. She's gonna listen to Papa. Well, highly educated. You know what she you know what her job is? She drives a school bus.
You think she listens to somebody like you, man? She go to concerts. She go to Bomb Beach. She go to Mike Jones. She go to, she go to concerts. Listening to you, she will, she'll be scared to go. Talking about it's going to be some kind of tunnel they're going to go through with all this old kind of mess, man. Man, what I'm telling you, once you get to trying to diss them hard hitters, and you're waking them up. I don't know what made Bumby wake up. He was coming from Los Angeles. He said, seen that boy sitting there? Tripping on that music. He don't know what triggered him. But he had his eyes. You ain't hear? And here you go with some kind of theory. Sitting on your butt on YouTube. Man, I don't even like this YouTube. Well, anyway. Let me. Let, I'm finna eat my sandwich. Let me, uh, let me tell you something, man. I don't have nothing. Against that L B uh uh A G whatever it is uh if you want listen to Montana Wolf he hollered at me on his video listen to Montana Wolf and you should look at one of them videos you broke he broke down on you talking about, man I asked you you saying one thing about having the kids now you go in a violent video with a with a nigga riding on side y'all he doing it this. Ain't no real nigga, man, that was on the side of you, man. That ain't, that's a nothing, a, a zero. And you, two zeros, hoping that nobody don't say nothing to you in New York. But you know what you were doing? Clicks. Please subscribe and follow. That's what you were doing that for, man. Don't narrate nothing over him, man. We don't need no more. We got a bunch of Amalans chases, man. We got, when an accident happened, you ought to see how many record, record trucks ride down, man. And we got seven or eight t television stations. Oh, we need your comment. Ain't that something? Oh, I'm helping somebody. How big are you helping somebody, man? Let me tell you something. Man, them people in Houston, Texas, that's LBG. When they let their hair down, they let their hair down, they put their purse on. They ain't like you. I respect them. I respect them. Every one of them. Every one of them. Some of them look good, just as good as a woman. They in their thing. I live on a whole stroll, fool. Ain't nothing but computerized, computerized pimping. The laws can't even trap them girls. So here you is. Man, you keep that theory. You hold that thought, but you keep it with you. Just like them dude told you. You can give out a lot of information about them all. Uh, abused and what is it? Molested and all of that. And you ought to look at that video that that dude that was in Rock Island which you just came out with, man. You know the one in which, which you used to play spades with and kept on slipping out? You need to look at that video and tell them them youths about that. Not about them hard hitters, man. You playing, you playing bad, man. Get off of that fence, man. Grab your purse. Grab your high heels. Even if it's a Texan jacket, wear that. I, I give you a thumbs up on that. Man, stay out of our business, man. I've already been on here too long. I'm gonna holler at Bum B though. I'm gonna tell him what's going on. About these frauds and these fakes. Not these frauds and fakes, but this nothing, this nobody, this knucklehead with a bunch of sheets.
Oh, there go my big puppy. Sheets. Filling up your pockets. You didn't read my comment. And if you make another one, I line up. Shoot my phone number right across there. If I catch it, because I be doing other things and I'm off into other things. That's the only way. Because I be catching them after you done done them. But this one yesterday, I don't know if yeah, it was live. I, I caught it because I wanted to see something. You faking, man. Oh, let me see. This is a... Uh-oh, yeah, keep doing what you're doing. HC, oh, uh, them haters gonna be, yeah, show sure is family. Man, my comment up in there too. How come, when I got on the phone, when I hit 10 toes, how come you hit me up? How come we talk for 15 minutes? How come I just got an email, because I asked him, I said, say, man, I'm laying to get out. Should I? I said, because I want you to see this video Bum B made, and I want you to see what this knucklehead made before I make a video. And I said, you be kind of like my mentor on this YouTube stuff. He hit me back. He said, you know what, man? Just let it do what it do. Youngster. The same one that broke down. That video where you point and showing a nigga getting all shot and that other nigga on the side of you know, all he doing is like, a, all you had to do was tie some strings to his head and have it dangling from the ceiling of that shit y'all was riding in. We don't do it like that down here, man. We don't need none of that, man. Think I'm lying? Oh, I'm gonna actually like come want to see. Still think I'm crazy. You think you could do what Ten Toes did? I don't think you could pull it off, man. Ain't no way in West Hell. This is in New York that that man pulled that off. Why you wasn't there? I watch every video he make. You know, Montana woke this boy. I subscribe to that sending you that message. This boy that I subscribe to that send you that message, read his comments. It ain't from no sheeps. Mm -mm. It's from a bunch of women, man. And they talking about you. It's funny what a, a nigga will do for some money. Man, don't try to bank off of us, man. We got enough ammo ass chasers and record drivers. I'm hardly pissed off. 